do a, uh, a dismount. What happens in Star when you're, you bring your weight too far that way and you flip forward this way, okay? So Sam's going to demonstrate how she can bring you down more gently than if I were just, or if her feet were just to stay in Star and I would land flat on my back this way, okay? Okay, so we're here. Let's say I start coming over too fast. Whoa! She has that foot. She's taking it off my shoulder and supporting my back a bit to where I'm not so kind of flat, you know? I'm not just going to fall flat this way. It's kind of a little bit of support. And it happens really fast. So with Sammy, what she can help me do is the lower that she can bring this foot here on my sacrum, the softer that kind of push will be. Uh, but it happens really fast, okay? So one thing that you can do as the flyer is if you feel like you're falling straight back, try not to do that. Um, try your best to, if you feel like you're falling back, turn. Right, bring your feet down, turn to the side so you can kind of spot the ground so that's a much safer fall than just back this way, okay? And that's something you can practice on the ground by doing headstands. Doing headstands like this and if you feel like you're falling straight on your back this way, you kind of just turn and bring your knees down on this side. Just keep that feeling of body control, figuring out how to turn your body and spot the land before you fall. Okay. That said, I want to practice just deliberately falling backwards this way as a dismount. So you do that with some going through that. So for this one, we will, instead of sitting in the straddle too, instead of staying in the straddle, I'm just punching my feet together, push my hips not here, but push them forward. Just stack once. And then she just pick one knee up, come back back, come back back. Yeah. You can really jack your shoulders that way too. So as you come back this way, I want you to, as the base, she's going to help guide your shoulders around and then back. Around and then back. So do you always hold her hand? Um, do I hold her feeling? hand? You know, you do. I think it starts to let go as the as as, coming as down. Motion is forward. There's a very loose grip. That's a great question, right? Because if she's holding on really tight, yeah. as I'm coming around like this, yes, it can really like. Strip me back. So nice open grip for her. Kind of guides you forward. But the most important thing is you'll feel this foot. One foot will be on your lower back, and the foot will stand on your shoulder and kind of guide you out. Kind of like when you do like a headstand over. Yep. Okay. Yes. So loose grip on your part too, as you're falling backwards. Nice loose grip. Pull out and then use the momentum to come on forward. Okay. And what Sammy can do to make that nice and easy is once she absorbs some of that weight. She can just gently push you forward. It's not a, it's a nice absorption <laughs> and then guiding you out. Good work.